Hi everybody, today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own corker ribbon by cooking it in your oven and it takes like 20-25 minutes to do, it's really easy. So you're going to start by getting a dowel rod. This is a one quarter inch, one quarter inch dowel rod. You're going to need some laundry clips and you're going to need gross grain ribbon. 3 8 inch gross grain ribbon. You're going to start by clipping on your ribbon and then you're just going to twist your ribbon down the dowel rod you can get a tighter curl by placing the ribbon close and tight together or you can get a looser curl by spacing it out a bit like so. I'm going to do mine a little tighter so I'm going to make sure they're pressed tightly together. You're just going to twist it all the way to the end and you'll want to snip it Place your second close hanger or close pen onto the end and you'll need a cookie sheet. Make sure you have your oven preheated to 275. You can do multiple dowel rods at one time. I'm just going to do one for an example, but you can do up to 10, 15 rods at once. So preheat your oven to 275. Okay. So now that your oven is preheated heated to 275, you will place your corker ribbon into the oven directly in on the cookie sheet, just like that. Set your timer for 20 minutes, and then it will be ready to pull off the dowel rod. Okay, so now that you've pulled out your corker ribbon out of the oven, let it cool, and once it's cooled, all you're going to do, take your clothespins off and just slightly untwist your ribbon and slide it off. And there you have it, corker ribbon. You can, um, if you want it extra stiff, you can spray it with some spray starch for um, right before you put it in the oven, and that will actually make it even more stiff. Then, this is the type of hair bow you will use corker ribbon for. These are corker hair bows. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Make sure to subscribe to our channel for more uh, easy DIY projects. Thanks for watching.